As the great Oscar Wilde once said, imitation is the sincerest form of flattery that mediocrity can pay to greatness. Good afternoon, Wheelies fans. We're going to look at uh, a competitor that's uh, making a similar product to our beach cart folding that we introduced in 2001. Uh, first, we'll take a look at the packaging. With the Wheelies packaging, you get a heavy duty corrugated carton crush resistant and you get a nice tight bundle with cart wheels and straps all put together. <clears throat> the axle tube which comes in contact with the outside carton has nice little protectors on it to keep these from punching through the carton. And the axle is securely fastened to the frame with cable zip ties. That is compared with the competitor here. We ordered one in. Of course, we did get two wheels, but I want to show you what is happening inside here. There are no protectors. Everything is just kind of loose and thrown into the box. And what was really concerning was that the legs <coughs> seem to be poking through the bottom of the box. And same with the axle. As a matter of fact, this was very close to just being lost along the way. Next, we decided to take a look at the frame. And we noticed that the frame on the competitor's cart very, very lightweight, felt light to the touch. And what we did was measure the thickness of the tubing they use, the steel tubing, and we find it's only one millimeter on this cart. And on the wheelies cart, it's actually two millimeters. What that translates to is a stronger frame for the wheelies cart. And that's important when you're hauling heavier loads, loaded coolers, and beach gear. There are some other subtle differences that make nice with the wheelies cart, such as tubing plugs. With the competitor, you just have open end tubes that are not very finished. With the wheelies cart, we're always using tube plugs and caps to keep the hard surface ground from damaging the cart. We also use these straps along the platform to keep the coolers from slipping back and forth and also to keep this bar here from contacting and getting scratched up on the ground. Next we decided to look at the wheel and on the competitor's cart they just give you an axle with these rather sharp and hard to work with cotter pins. Not very conducive to taking the wheels on and off your cart. With the wheelies wheel, if you want to pack it up and bundle it like the one out of the shipping cart in there, we have a twist lock knob mounted onto the wheel and a groove tip axle so there is no cotter pin and no hassle with taking the wheel on and off. When we further examined the wheels, we found that the competitor had a wheel that uh, can get out of round in hot environments and maybe not come back into round. This one here you can see is lopsided and it hasn't even really been exposed to the heat yet. With the wheelies wheel you're getting uh, high quality polyurethane and that has an excellent rebound characteristics and comes true round. Very important so you don't have a wobbling cart. Those are just a few of the reasons why uh, they imitate us and we hope you enjoyed this film.